Mangroves are the most prominent vegetation to be found along the coast. Mangroves are impervious to salt and have evolved as the natural barrier which prevents coastal erosion and the intrusion of the sea into the land. This is the coastland of Sei, one of the turtle islands located on the offshore portion of Demachifdom, Bonth district. One can see how close the inland freshwater lagoon is situated to the open sea. Mangroves help ensure that islands and coastal environments continue to have fresh water, but this delicate balance is under threat on this small island. Nyangai, one of the other turtle islands, is separated in two halves by the tides. The residential portions of these islands are protected by a minimal strip of mangrove vegetation and without more being planted, Nyangai and other neighboring islands are under threat of dissolving into the Atlantic Ocean. Mangroves, therefore, protect the fragile nature of islands, serving as a barrier to high tides and against increasing sea levels due to climate change. However, like many places along the world's tropical coastlines, mangroves have been ravaged for different purposes. Here in Conakry D of Kafabulam Chiefdom, the proximity of the population to the mangroves has created pressure on these adjacent sources of firewood. In especially fishing-based communities like Konakridi, decades of mangrove destruction have left vast areas without this protective vegetation. Throughout Kaboro chiefdom in Moyamba district, the estimated quantity of mangroves lost to land reclamation is at least 10,000 hectares. This is according to the Sierra Leone Artisanal Fishermen's Union, which is opposed to mangrove removal because these areas also serve as the spawning ground for fish. SLBC witnessed voluntary efforts being undertaken by environmentalists like the Sierra Leone Artisanal Fishermen's Union to begin replanting the lost mangroves. This gathering in Yondu, Moyamba district, addressed task force members assembled from 30 communities to identify the planting material for mangroves for the purpose of replanting. The Moyamba and Banth districts have the greater quantity of mangroves contained in Sierra Leone's portion of the Grand Mano landscape, but the western area also contains significant mangrove reserves which are part of the Sierra Leone River estuary. Laka is a tourist location that has suffered from coastline erosion due to sand mining. Mangroves to be replanted here would help reaffix the sand dunes. Hamilton has lost even more beach to sand mining, but there is more potential for restoration in the area of Hamilton located for tourism development. Tumbo, along the Yari Bay, embodies all the threats posed against the mangroves with its own visibly vast areas of degradation. For coastal communities in Sierra Leone and elsewhere, the ecosystem services provided by the mangroves are visible game changers for fresh water provision, food security, aquaculture, fishing, and tourism. These are the economic drivers which underscore the importance of mangroves and the need for their protection. Especially for the Turtle Islands, a natural disaster influenced by climate change cannot be defended against unless the coastline is comprehensively revegetated. <laughs>